for the last two years, the people were telling me that, Jean, you should be tired, you did enough. Of course, I did enough for you, but for myself, I know I can go beyond my limits, you know? Um, that's why I became two-time world champion. One thing that I know with my win versus Marcus Brown is never let anyone's opinion become your reality. It's not because someone's telling you you washed up, you no good, you ugly, you have to let this become your reality. I said, you know what, fuck them. I'm better than that, I still have some gas in the tank, and I became two-time world champion. I always, I always say, they tell me, is he ready right now? I said, no, this is a process. We're still going through the levels, and it's a daily thing. Every workout is a workout we put in the bank. All right? But we make sure that every day the workout we do, we can add to the next level, we can add to the next level. As we're building what's to be unveiled on that night, I showcase of a fighter. So on fight night, he will be ready mm -hmm. when the bell rings. Mm -hmm. I know that for a fact. Yeah. He's a true warrior. True yeah, he's a warrior. He's a, he's a warrior. <laughs> Me on the mission, it's to be follow May, May 20th. And one thing that I learned, it's more funds, more fun. So I win this fight, I got more funds for more funds, baby. <laughs> I've been training in Miami since so nice, so I don't remember exactly how many training camp I did in Miami, but. It's been a lot. I remember when I fought Chad Dawson in 2010, I was right here in Miami and I beat him. And it's supper. So, Falong, get ready. That's where, like, we, uh, they shoot Scarface. So, be able to see Chi Chi, get the yayo. Yeah. Yo, Chi Chi, get the yayo. You already know, Scarface, baby. It's all about the legacy. It's about the legacy. If your goal is money, you have the wrong dream, the wrong goal. Because as soon as you get that money, the passion is going to be gone. But if you aim to be the best, the pound for pound best, the money is going to come with it. The girl is going to come with it. But as soon as, as soon as you touch a million, if your goal is money, you're going to quit. So that's why I like Floyd. So I made a ton of money, but he's still grinding hard because his goal was not to get money. His goal was to be TBE. And that's why he became TBE. And for myself, I'm TBE in Canada, baby, the best ever. Boom. <laughs> Pascal hasn't declined. How can anyone make the statement that Pascal is past his prime, you know, and even done if his last fight he won, the fight before that he won? How can you say that? No. Now what they can look at is the only thing they can say is, has the question is, has the 31 months inactive been a factor? That's what they can look at, but not that he's done. So this is a question of how much rust, if he has any rust. Well, that's where I come in. I make sure that by, by the time fight night, the unveiling happens, I took away whatever rust there was, I polished, fine-tuned, and he's ready to go. I can make inactivity seem as if he was active. How? Well, through tricks of the trade and hard work. Fight! Hey, hey, hey. Hi, 
Reggie. Hey, what's, uh, how are you? How are you doing today? I'm doing good. I'm a little bit tired after training, but I will survive. Yeah, well, you're looking good. Thank you, thank you. Um, my name is Lisa. I'm here with uh, Scion Laboratory today. Okay. And we're here to do an observed urine uh, with your consent. Mm -hmm. That's okay? Yep. Okay, um, so I do have some paperwork. Here, let me move this over. Um, I'll have you sit here and I'll explain that. Your date of birth. All right, and then here, um, you need to put your initials there where the X's are. Um, so now I'm going to direct you to the bathroom where you will collect um, your urine sample with Justin. And I'll be waiting out here for it. Can you bring me some water, please? Yes. Thanks. Gene, I'm just going to confirm um, your date of birth with you is 10-28-1982. Uh, 1994. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I wish. Oh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, 82. See, guys, I'm doing a test, a pee test, urine test, blood test. I don't know what happened the first time, but I never tried to hide myself, you know. I'm the one who was asking my people to do some testing. When I fought Kovalev, when I fought Bernard Hopkins, when I fought Lucien Boutte, I've been tested many times and always came back negative. Last time, I don't know what happened, but I just want to prove like probably it was a mistake because I'm a clean athlete, I'm a honest person, and I want to and I want to have a clean sport as well. So that's why I'm still doing it to show you guys. We call this DNA Pascal. <laughs> <laughs> 